Mr. Chairman. <clears throat> Tomorrow at 10 a.m., uh, there will be a groundbreaking for P&B cold storage. That location is 1825 Bevo Boulevard. Uh, Ms. Lovern can help you with directions there. This is a groundbreaking, though, on behalf of the Development Authority, um, bringing more jobs to Lowndes County, which is always exciting. Also, on Thursday at 9 a.m., uh, the historic courthouse team will be hosting our local hoteliers for a tour of the historic courthouse. From October to May, uh, since we cut the ribbon to we ran these numbers in May, there have been over 3,000 visitors to the historic courthouse. Um, we are seeing now that many of those are coming from out of state, other parts of the state, even out of the country. Um, so uh, uh, Jess Gaines and Megan thought that it would be a good idea to host a tour um, for our front line, our hoteliers. You see those folks whenever they come into town to learn more about the facility, drive more traffic downtown. Um, on Thursday at 9 a.m., we will be having our one and only budget public hearing here. Um, so we will see you all on Thursday at 9 a.m. here. Then on Saturday at 9 a.m., apparently 9 a.m. is the, uh, the, time, the time of the week. On Saturday, uh, we will have a, uh, a charitable walk for the Griffith family. Um, Firefighter Griffith with Lowndes County Fire Rescue, his wife Sarah, has received a significant brain cancer diagnosis and they are having to go to Florida daily for treatments. So the fire department has rallied around them and they're holding a walk for charity for them at Freedom Park on nine, at 9 a.m. on Saturday if you'd like to join us there. Um, it is a five mile walk around the walking path, but there's shade and you don't have to walk the whole five miles. Um, so if you can't make it, but you'd also like to contribute, please let me know and I'll help you with that. And then uh, next Wednesday, June the 19th, the office will be closed in recognition of the Juneteenth holiday. Um, also, we will be emailing to you um, the information, the survey information that Mary Beth mentioned earlier in the event that you all have not seen that yet and you're not aware, you're not aware of how to find it, we'll send it directly to you um, if you would like to participate in that survey. I think it would be fantastic because you all all um, represent some form of industry or community service in the work that you do every day, so that perspective is certainly valuable and uh, Mr. Ty and I will be leaving this afternoon. We're visiting with Georgia Power tomorrow. Uh, we've been invited to be a part of their annual storm update as they move into storm season uh, to learn more about what their resources are going to be, what the priority of that is going to be and how that would impact us. I think that um, we're grateful for the invitation. It's especially important this year given uh, the information that we've received so far from National Weather Service. Any questions?